junk of dope. We ain't got resources to help us.
parents can't even beat children. Public safety is not terrorizing the youth, the poor, the black, the brown, the ones who are always this criminalized, treated like trash. No justice! No peace! No racist!
street, in the ring, everywhere. I didn't fought. If ever I knew that I was going to be a part of a fight, but I ain't never wear no slippers. I ain't never go and put on no slides. I put on sneakers, I put on boots. What the officer did to Jarena when she was all the way back behind the fight, behind people that was recording the fight, behind people that had their phones, behind police officers that was already responding to the fight, there was nothing that would warrant a late-come police officer from grabbing her. There, there's no reason that he would have to grab her, put her on the ground, and sit on her back. Jarena, 100 pounds. Jarena is her size. Maybe her size. She little. She done lost a lot of weight. When she got her hip surgery, back when she was 11, 12 years old, when her hip was replaced, she started to gain weight. But she lost that weight. Now she's sitting at home, not oh, yeah. able to do anything, because a 250 pound officer sat on her back and cuffed her, gave her a stress fracture in her back. It's not right. I don't have children. Jerome Green, Jarena's dad, is not here in the physical form to fight for his daughter. Okay. I knew Jerome Green. When I was 18 years old, I looked up for Jerome Green. I looked up for him. He was somebody. That if I got in trouble on the bus, if I was in a fight, whatever it was, he was on my side. He wasn't somebody that was going to jump in and do nothing bad to me. Boomer was a good dude. In 2008, when he was shot on 23rd Street, I was there. I saw that man die on the street because the ambulance took too long to come. Mm -hmm. At that time, I didn't have a car. Jarena was a baby. She's still a baby. 17 years old, she's her size. Can you imagine, mom, can you imagine 250 pound police officer picking her up, sitting on her back? What would you do? What would you do? Can't even think about it. I can't imagine what I would do. I don't have children. You carried this for nine months. Right? This is my story. Got twins right now. This the niece. You want to say something? You want to say nothing about your dad? No justice. No peace. No justice. No peace. No racist police. No justice. No peace. No racist police. So for anybody 
that wasn't here when we first got here. We have a statement with our demands. Pastor Dexter. No justice. No peace. No racist. Police. And I do want Lakeisha to get home. I want everybody to get home safe, especially her because she's carrying twins. So after I read this, we can disperse, but plan on the next plan of action, the next. We're going to be out here again next week more than likely. Where, where is the... Uh, Okay. <laughs> Brother Keith, you gonna be able to send this to me, share this? Yeah, I got it. It's on live right now. Dear members of the community, of our collective community, the Delaware Poor People's Campaign alongside the NAACP, Working Families Party, Democratic Socialist Party, strongly denounced a recent incident of racial violence in our community. On Friday, September 16th, Jarita Green, a student at Concord High School was at a Brandywine High School football game in Newcastle County and was shouting with her peers about the football game when she was thrown to the ground and forcefully restrained by a Newcastle County police officer. Several youth urged the officers to cease restraining Green as Green, who identifies as black, lives with an artificial hip and suffered a severe stress fracture in her back, resulting from police treatment of her. Additionally, officers charged Green with inciting a riot and inappropriate response to the actions taken on behalf of Green by fellow students. As a movement committed to nonviolence and the ending of an interlocking injustice of systemic racism and poverty, as well as militarism and the war economy, the Delaware Poor People's Campaign calls for justice and accountability for Jarena Green. On Tuesday, September 27th, members of the Delaware Poor People's Campaign, along with the NAACP, Working Families Party, Democratic Socialist Party, Roslyn Webb, the mother, Toya Webb, the aunt, Derek Johnson, pastor of Joshua Harvest Church. And if I could... If I can have the liberty of saying some names today, who's with us today? Brother King, Black Lives Matter Delaware, Chief Booker, Akisha Nix, sister of Lamar Moses, Keandra McDowell, sister of Jeremy McDowell, Brendan Fletcher, Metropolitan Wolves Urban League, Network Delaware, Kobe Owens, who mentioned the NAACP. Everybody stand together. If you want your name to be said, say your name. What's your name? Juanita Holloway. Juanita Holloway. Hey, Ayani Williams. Ayani Williams, who spoke today. Mrs. Holloway, do you want to say something? Hey. All right. When we get back to it, we demand the following. First, first, Joseph Black, Chief, Chief of the Green. Chief of Newcastle County Police, 
and or Matt Myers, Newcastle County executives, immediately released the names of the Newcastle County police officers involved in altercation. Joseph Buck, chief of Newcastle County Police, and or Matt Myers, Newcastle County executive, immediately released full body camera footage to the public. Third and last, all charges against Jarena Green be immediately dropped. No justice! No, no peace! Since you're ready to talk now, Mom, some words from the mother, Rosalind Webb. Keep up the good fight! 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 I appreciate everybody coming out today. You should use the big boy, Mom. Right here. No justice! No peace! Now you gotta just push the button. Just push the button. Just push it. I appreciate everybody coming out today to support my daughter Jarena Green. We're coming out today because all we want is the body footage, the officer name. I didn't get to speak to no one really yet about nobody like a police officer. They did call me asking all these crazy questions. But we're going to be out here at least once a month. Fighting for the body footage. Whatever we got to do, we're going to fight. I'm a fighter. I'm not giving up at all. No. Nope. I'm a fighter. No justice. No, no peace. peace. No justice. No, no peace.